welcome back to another video. Um, this is a follow-up to a video I made a little while back, uh, you know, uh, crossbows versus bows. And uh, uh, in that I demonstrated that crossbows are basically better because while bows do get infinity, um, infinity doesn't work with uh, um, tipped arrows where piercing basically means you can recollect your tipped arrows and tipped arrows are just stronger than regular arrows so that gives them um, yeah. an edge of uh, bows and essentially they put out the same DPS but there was one thing that I wanted to mention but I wasn't 100% sure about it so I've got Axolotl here to help me uh, test this out. Hello. Right, so Axolotl, first shoot me with a regular bow. Okay, it does go through the shield a bit and it uh, did over half health to me. I should give myself some golden carrots. So, oh, actually, uh, E F F E C T at P in percent health 10 10. So. Um, now shoot me with the crossbow. Hmm, does the same amount of damage. Okay. So, that was a little bit unexpected. So, what I expected to happen is, um, for the bow, uh, when I, when you shot, what I expected to happen is that the bow, regular bow, would just plink off the shield. Oh, it sort of does. So, it plinks off the shield, but still does damage to you. So, that might be a glitch. Uh, might not. Cannot. I cannot neither confirm nor deny that. Where I was expecting the piercing crossbow to just go straight through. Because of the piercing effect. It does. Does the piercing effect. Yeah, it does go through, but it, it does the same amount of damage as a regular bow. So I don't know if that's a glitch or that the, like maybe the bow should not be doing uh, as much damage or what's going on there like meh let's let's try with a axe a lot of bow try with a regular bow hmm still goes through and does the same amount of damage so ah What's going on here is probably because it's uh, arrows of harming. Um, the it's probably like the potion effect is still taking effect. Try with regular arrows. Oh, hold on. Ah, I'll just do. Oh, if I could not sausage finger uh, at A. Yeah, so just shoot me with some regular arrows. Yeah, it's not going through with the regular bow. Now do it with the crossbow. Uh, that will say instant damage arrow, I think. No, it wasn't. No. There are my instant. Hmm. I am actually taking damage. Uh, you shoot me true. with regular arrows. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I am taking a little bit of damage, but not much. So yeah. Regular bow just brings off, but crossbow you do take a little bit of damage. But my protect, but because it's just regular arrows, my protect the protection for on the armor is just nullifying the damage like if i take the ammo off shoot me again yeah you yeah. so yeah i was kind of right uh, in thinking that crossbows do hit through shields where bows don't but it has to be regular arrows and uh, not tipped arrows which is sort of a bit of a giving and take here because um again uh, infinity bows don't make uh, instant uh, damage at well tipped arrows infinite, where, pier where crossbows don't make have infinity for regular arrows. So it's just like kind of 
Yeah, kind of an interesting interaction there. But um, I'm thinking that um, bows uh, hitting uh, with tipped arrows may be a glitch. Like, it definitely seems like uh, um, a bit glitchy because um, as we saw with, when, with the regular arrows, they just bounced off the shield where... Um, you, you want to shoot it again? Mm. So, yeah, you can see those the regular arrows just bounce off. So I think maybe the, uh, the tipped arrow effect is uh, like ignoring the fact that regular arrows just that the arrows are supposed to just like plink off the shield which is a bit odd um yeah this is uh, this has been interesting to learn um so yeah if you uh, if you're in pvp and you don't have access to uh tipped arrows definitely go with crossbow because um it will um be better off in the long one. Anyway, it's not really doing that much damage. Uh, I can keep shooting for a while. Like, oh yeah, if you take your arm off, you'll die in a couple of seconds. Well, even then, if protection for Neverite gear is not exactly the easiest thing to get, like um, if you've watched like um, Third Life and Last Life. Um, most uh, most people in last life now don't even really have diamond armor and um, very few people have diamond armor period and the people that do have diamond armor don't have like them fully enchanted and nobody really has a neverite armor so let's try with hold on one let's try with regular diamond unenchanted diamond Yeah. Okay. Shoot me with the crossbow now. Oh yeah, it's doing half a heart. So yeah, if you're in a um in a setting that like last life or third life where resources are fairly limited, um then using a piercing crossbow um, if you can get piercing which shouldn't be too difficult because there's not many enchantments you can get on a crossbow so maybe for like rain fell or something like that. it does take a while to wheel them down um, which is why uh, when you watch like Third Life and uh, uh, Last Life, you'll mostly see them using ranged, um, you know, bows, ranged attacks when the enemy is uh, fleeing and they don't have their shields up, which is when a punch bow um, is most effective because they're running away. And they don't have the shields up, so you can just fling them a couple of times and kill them. Um, there's also something to be said about... Um, there's one more thing that I want to uh, talk about here uh, with a crossbow versus bow. Is that when you're holding shield, if you've got... Your, if you're drawing your bow, then you're not shielded. So Axel could just come up and punch me because the shield's not activated. <coughs> Uh, so that's not very uh, good because then uh, they can shoot you. But uh, Axel can punch me now, even though the crossbow is fully drawn, the shield's up. So I can shoot, recharge my bow, and it, uh, uh, if you shine a light, they won't even be able to hit you, and they just die. So that is another um, advantage the crossbow does have over the bow is that if you pair with a shield, um, you're quite strong. And obviously with the tip towers you go through armour.
Um, and obviously, um, uh, even the protection wouldn't really help there because Tip Tarot, the potion effect from Tip Tarot, ignore the enchantment. So if you if Axel puts the uh, enchanted Neverite Armor back on. It still only takes a couple of shots to kill him. So yeah, this was um, this was like quite interesting because I learned a couple of things about uh, the crossbows and bows interaction with shield, um, and it, uh, yeah, and I hope that you guys all did learn something too. Hope you did enjoy this uh, short little video, and I'll see you guys in uh, whatever I decide to do next. Bye bye. Bye.